as the night wore on, Daniel's peaceful sleep was interrupted by faint sounds that reached his ears. Half asleep, he dismissed them as the usual noises of winter. But nature had other plans, and soon he felt the urge to use the bathroom. He groggily rose from his bed, slipped on his coat, and ventured out into the frigid night. As he approached the door, ready to dig his way through, he froze in his tracks. A large beast lay motionless by the entrance, just a few feet away from him. Fear gripped his heart, and he took a step back. The creature, a magnificent tiger, lifted its head and stared at Daniel with curious eyes. The tiger's neck bore a ghastly wound, an ugly reminder of the cruelty humans were capable of inflicting. It was a metal loop, a snare set by heartless poachers who saw the beautiful tiger as nothing more than a commodity. Compassion overcame fear, and Daniel knew he had to help. Calmly, he approached the wounded tiger, who surprisingly didn't show aggression, but rather a sense of understanding. It was as if the creature sensed that Daniel meant no harm. With steady hands, the paramedic carefully released the tiger from the cruel snare. The animal let out a low growl, as if thanking him, and then remained still as Daniel cleaned and treated the wound as best he could. Over the next few days, Daniel tended to the tiger's wound diligently, feeding him and ensuring he had enough water to drink. The tiger seemed to trust the kind-hearted human, and a bond formed between them. As the days passed, the tiger's strength returned, and his wound began to heal. One morning, Daniel awoke to find the tiger gone. He felt a pang of sadness, but knew that the wild was the rightful place for such a magnificent beast. A week passed, and Daniel was unsure if he would ever see the tiger again. He had nearly convinced himself that it had merely been a beautiful dream born from exhaustion and the winter night's mysteries. But then, one morning, when he stepped outside to start his day, he found a remarkable surprise. Lying on his doorstep was a large, freshly killed deer. It was an unmistakable gesture of gratitude from the tiger. Tears welled up in Daniel's eyes as he realized that his kindness had touched the heart of a wild creature. In the days that followed, the tiger occasionally returned, leaving gifts of its successful hunts on Daniel's doorstep.